Today we're going to be subtracting two numbers within a thousand. We are going to be using the same methods of drawing the base 10 blocks and expanded form. But before we do that, I want to go over some quick vocabulary. We're starting with a menu end and a subtraction problem. The number that we're taking away is called the subtrahend, and our answer in subtraction is called the difference. You will hear me use these words in this video, so I wanted to go over that first. So let's look at this video with our, let's look at our base 10 blocks on the screen. So in order to subtract, we have to start with our menu end. Our menu end is 654. So I'm gonna use my flats to represent my hundreds, my rods to represent my tens, and my single units to represent my ones. And I'm gonna show 654. So I've got six hundreds, five tens, and four ones. Now I'm going to be taking away 234. So I'm not going to be adding on 234. So I'm not going to put 234 underneath here. Instead, I'm taking it away. So we will be comparing or taking away. That is what subtraction means. And we knew that addition mean, meant to combine like things. So with subtraction, we're gonna take away 234. So I'm gonna just expand 234 to help me take away each of those place values. So starting at the ones, I need to take away four ones. So one, two, and I'm just crossing them out to show that they are gone. Three, four. These four ones are gone. Now it's time to take away three tens. One, two, three. Three tens equals 30. 10, 20, 30. I have two tens left over. And now I need to take away 200. 100, 200. So I have 654 and I just took away 234. Let's see what's left. We have four hundreds left, which is worth 400. And I know that they're left over because they're not crossed out. We have two tens left. Two tens are worth 20. And again, I know these two tens are left over because these are the only two tens that aren't crossed out. And we have no ones left over. We got rid of all of our ones. So that leaves me with my answer or my difference as 420. And there are no ones. So my answer here is 420. So let's work on this with drawing. We're going to use our place value chart like we did with addition. I'm going to do it, go ahead and do my ones, tens, and hundreds. And we're only representing the menu end. So I'm only going to represent 600, 50, remember my, my sticks are my rods, four, my dots are my ones. Now I'm going to take away my subtrahend. So I know that that is 200 plus 30 plus four. 234 is 200 plus 30 plus four. So I'm gonna take away four ones. One, two, three, four. I am left with no ones. I'm gonna take away three tens or 30, 10, 20, 30. I have two tens left over. Two tens is worth 10, 20. So I have 10, 20 left. And then I'm going to take away two hundreds. And when I take away two hundreds, I have one, two, three, four hundreds left. And my answer is 420. Let's try this with expanded form. So I'm gonna show 600 plus 50 plus four, and I'm taking away 234. Four minus four is nothing. 50 minus 30 is 20, because I know that 20 plus 30 equals 50. 600 minus 200 is 400, because I know that 400 plus 200 is 600. My answer is 420, or my difference to the problem is 420. Let's do one more. Seven hundred sixty-nine minus 
257. This is my menu end and my subtrahend, and this is my difference. I want to represent my menu end. So I've got ones, tens, hundreds. So I want to represent 700, 69. I just represented 769. I want to take away my subtrahend. So I'm taking away 257. I expanded 257. So let's start with my ones. I'm going to take away seven ones. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Remember those X's mean that they're taken away, which is what subtraction means. Taking away or comparing. I am left with two ones. Now, Let's take away five tens, or 50, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50. I'm only left with one 10. Now let's take away 200, 100, 200. I am left with 100, 200, 300, 400, 500. So my difference is 512. 500 plus 10 plus two is 512. Let's do this with expanded form. So we already expanded out 769. So now let's expand out 257 and we're gonna subtract. Nine minus seven is two. 60 minus 50 is 10 because 10 plus 50 is 60. 700 minus 200 is 500 because 500 plus 200 is 700. So I get 512 as my difference. The difference between 769 and 257 is 512. Now you're going to practice subtracting using drawings or expanded form.